Hello, this is Kiki. Uh, doing let's play, revisit conflict to uh, B. Uh, this is a bomber versus bomber fight to show you that uh, just because they're two bombers doesn't mean they have the same stats. Uh, as you can see there, uh, my bomber has a mini Vulcan while he has a machine gun. A 30 millimeter machine gun, I think. Uh, so basically, I can do make one point more damage than him. Uh, make one or two points, I don't know. I don't really know how much it affects otherwise, though. But uh, this kind of gives you an idea of just kind of how the combat works. Uh, if you see the side of the plane. I, I think I said this on another video, but just kind of rephrase it. Um, basically, like if you see nothing on the screen there, like I said, uh, means that there's no enemy there, and that you don't see them. If you see the back of the back of it, that means that you're behind them. If uh, you see the side of them, that means that you're you're like on his like three or tw you're on his three or you're on his nine o'clock uh, so just use those as a reference guide uh, for if especially like if you're doing ground and ground battles it, that's extremely important to know the position of how your camera look, looks at them because it lets you know if you're on the side of them or if you're behind them or if you're uh, in front of them to set up your shots or let you know if what you need to do to uh, get them back on your screen. Uh, generally turn is the most used to uh, get there. Also look. Uh, those are the two most common if you're playing it'd be loop or uh, roll. Uh, if you're like a helicopter, it would just be turn. Um, so uh, just kind of keep that in mind. Uh, adjust works to uh, just if you're needing to fine tune your shot. And look is just it gives is a more focused version of adjust. And the game can force you to attack. Uh, like this, this here is a prime example of how the game forces you to attack. Uh, if you don't want to attack, you have to attack anyway. So, uh, basically, you have to do it from there. Uh, and uh, battles lost for for that one. It was like three minutes long. So. Uh, about it was about a three-minute fight. Uh, you sh you're looking near for a ceasefire or something to happen. And uh, I should be, hopefully, if that bomber goes away, I should be able to win the game, hopefully, or at least put some serious hurt on the enemy uh, ship. There, I'm in bombing. I'm in bomber range. I was trying to take the bomber out uh, because he can put a serious hurt on uh, my ta my tank, and uh, my my fame points are so low that I can't defend against it, against it. So it's basically a do or die situation. Uh, and also, if you want to heal your stuff up, you have to go to either a town or you have to go to a airport if you're aircraft. Oh uh, well, now I know I'm especially in bomber range, and he's producing a fighter already to try to take out my bomber. And luckily, he pulls his bomber back to uh, heal up, so that that gives me a little bit of time. I think uh, th there's another comparison. I think this one fully heals up, while uh, Advanced Wars only does two points per turn, and it's based on your cash. So, uh, 
that's another thing to check out and uh, don't quote me on that because I haven't tested it if somebody has actually played conflict and uh, can tell me if it's a full heal or not please post it uh, but I'm just basing off my assumptions considering that the town capture is just automatic when you pop it on there versus advanced wars you have to jump on it uh, and capture it with an infantry guy this one you can have aircraft take it over fighters can take it bombers can take it helicopters can take it it doesn't matter and I still don't understand this the enemy unit can be captured or can't be captured I, I don't get that text there if somebody can explain that mechanic too I'd appreciate it also this game seems to favor if you use your uh, missiles more than your machine guns uh, to do auto kills and whatnot. Uh, basically I think it's just to quickly kill your infantry or your enemy off quicker is just use your missiles. Uh, but this is a prime example here of how look and adjust and uh, all that kind of work. Uh, like I said I believe that I'm set up to where I can uh, win this in the next part. Uh, so I'll let you know. Uh, I should know on part three. I'm not. I'm not quite sure. Uh, this being part 2B, of course. So uh, basically, I just did a uh, did one mass recording of it uh, for each like segment. Since RTS games are notorious for being long. Uh, I'm on, oh, also I came across a DS game that uh, looks quite similar to uh, Panzer General. Uh, I might do a comparison of that one. Uh, I believe they call it Panzer Commander or something to that effect. Uh, so I might try that one out. See how that one goes. Anyway, this will be the uh, end of Part 2B. Uh, Kiki signing out. Thank you.